Hey, what's up, y'all? Tectone here, and today I am delivering some pretty bad news. Which, by the way, I am in no way responsible for any of this. So before you leave that comment saying, Tectone, how could you do this to me? Know that it's not my fault. So yeah, you can probably see by the thumbnail or the title, this is kind of a bummer drummer. Okay? I've known about this for about 12 hours so far. My wife woke me up from when I was sleeping, and all I heard her say was, Oh no! And I'm like, honey, what's wrong? And then she showed me the screen of her phone, and yeah, Sinoalis is gonna be delayed into, until a further date. When? We don't know yet. When I first heard this, I was absolutely devastated. And it had affected me all day because I've been looking forward to this game for I would say well over half a year well over half a year I was looking forward to this exact day I took I cleared my entire schedule for this game's release and to get this kind of news now so close to the launch it was less than two days when we got this the game is going to be delayed message it was kind of a bummer so I'm gonna read y'all the exact message that we got Hello everyone, this is the management team for Sino Alice. First and foremost, we would like to express our sincerest apologies, thank God, to inform everyone who has been waiting a long time for the worldwide launch that, that the service schedule has been delayed. Sino Alice is a work in progress that began last year during which we aim to open its services on July 18th, 2019. As the opening date draws nearer, we have been running our final maintenances and checkups for the global service. However, we have come to the conclusion that the localization quality of Sinoalis is nowhere near perfect at this stage of development. So now what localization quality means, it's fine for the Japanese servers, but it's not good over here. Now that can range from censorship. That can range from... You know, you know how like you have a group of friends and you tell a joke with one group of friends that's really, really funny and then you tell it to like your mom and dad and they're like, I don't get it. It could also be talking about like making sure that the, that the, that it kind of translate well um, to a Northern American audience or just making sure that the, the humor and, and the storylines make sense um, are, are just universal in general or it could just mean that shit, our servers suck. And we don't want that to be the people's first experience. And I'll get into that more later, right? So in this regard, we have made many decisions with the Japanese developers and at the cost of rescheduling the worldwide launch, we have decided to optimize the localization of the game to provide the highest level of satisfaction for all users. As the service schedule has been delayed, we are fully aware that many of you are disappointed once again, and we take this opportunity to apologize for our shortcomings. Now, this right here, sure, they're doing the whole corporate royal we things, but you can tell they're just as disappointed as we are, okay? You can tell that they didn't want this to happen, okay? At least that's how I'm taking. They did not want this to happen. As much hype as there was, as much hype there was built up for the global service of Sino Alice, which was a lot, by the way, like a hell of a lot, like oh my god, which I'll also get into more later. Our priority is to provide you with an experience that exceeds your expectations. We hope you understand that we have made a very difficult decision in delaying our global services. Yeah, this is also. This sucks for them because there was so much hype. And yeah, this is going to kill hype for a lot of people because there was a lot of bandwagoners. I mean, there was a lot. So this is hurting them just as much as it's hurting us as well. The future worldwide launch schedule is currently being negotiated. As much as you are curious about the exact date of the release, we will try our best to bring you the fully localized version of Sinnoh Alice as soon as possible. Furthermore, come... Uh, Com compensatory rewards for the that's a, that's a word furthermore you will be compensated with rewards for the service delay uh that we are currently discussing internally this is a word a little bit weirdly weirdly or i need to go back to like eighth grade english and retake it or something furthermore <laughs> i already read that anywho once again we would like to express our sincere apologies to everyone who has shown so much love and interest in the house okay so once again this sucks what does it all mean Game's not coming out. They're sorry. We're going to be compensating with some big old goodies, which is dope. But unfortunately, we don't know the release date. 
there was some mentionings of September 30th, but I'm really hoping it's not that release date. But if they need that much time, I understand. So, let me tell you why this is actually a really, really good thing. Okay? There is so much hype built for this game. There is over a million pre-registers. Honestly, I'd probably guess that there's nearing two million pre-registers for this game. I, if I was if I was spitballing it, I'd probably say we're getting there right now, right? We're getting there. So, we now know that Nexon Korea, who is in charge of this, and maybe even Square Enix too, if we're still a little bit hands-on, they care so much that this game is a goddamn home run the moment that it comes out. And that's very reassuring. So that's one thing. Now we know the company really cares and they're not about making as much money as possible like everybody's saying. They're not about, oh, give me money, 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 money. Because they could have released it. And you know people still would have spent money. Tons. But they're like, mm, maybe we should wait. Okay? And they did. And that's a really good thing. So we know we have a company that's going to make sure that the launch of this game, which by the way is extremely important. It's extremely important. Is going to go on bang on. Okay? So that's the first thing. Second of all, if any of y'all were interested in playing this game, just because it had over a million pre-registers, and I know a lot of people from my community who are only going to try this just because of how much genuine interest there is in this game, if they were excited about one million, how many pre-registers do you think there's going to be when this game actually does release? Because now people know that they're stoked for this. Now, there was a lot of people who weren't aware of this game, and the longer we wait, the more people who will become aware and the more player base that there, there will be. By the way, Cinewells is not your typical gotcha. Everything you do is with other people. The more people there are, the better experience it's going to be for us. So, that's another big check for absolutely getting into the game, absolutely making sure the launch sequence is amazing. It's going to be dope. Hell, shit, I'm predicting we'll get over 3 million pre-registers if this is delayed more than a month, which I really hope it's not, but if it is, I understand, right? I don't want to play a broken game. I do not want to play a broken game, because nothing is worse than people getting in there, playing a game, they experience a bug, I'm out. This is making sure that we don't lose any of the players who have waited and who are ready to get in there, and they get in there, and they'll have a good experience. That's important because player retention is incredibly important, especially for a game as interactive as Cinewells. There's really no other gacha that's as interactive as this game. There's really not. So making sure that the company gives a shit, the player base will continue to give a shit by having a good user experience. I know I'm not just trying to be positive. I'm really not, but I took a step back. And I know for a lot of y'all, this is the first time that you're hearing about it. And I really apologize that I had to be the one to deliver the bad news. But just know that all of this was being done out of a place of care and a place of wanting to have success with the video game and wanting us, the players, to have a good time. So, yes, was I obliterated beyond all belief? Yeah, I'm an absolute loser, okay? I just play video games all the time. I can't control myself, okay? I get way too excited. I'm straight up like I'm a loser, y'all. I was like I play video games too much, so I get a little bit attached to, to wanting to play the games that I want to play. Right? I get way too invested. <laughs> that aside, yeah, it sucks. Yeah, I was obliterated. Yeah, I stopped streaming today because I was so sad about this and I couldn't handle it because I was just shitting on everything because my disappointment from Sino Alice was completely. It was immeasurable. It was immeasurable. But I got out of the house, spent some time with my wife, did some grocery shopping, just contemplated, reflected, and realized that this is going to be the best thing for the game. So now, where does that leave me? Am I giving up on Sino Alice? No. Obviously not. I'm still, honestly, more hyped than ever, knowing that when this game actually does come out, it's going to be a goddamn Grand Slam. So... What am I going to do for the channel? Because obviously I can't make any more Cinema House content. I can't. I don't want to make any more Japanese things. Y'all can't read that. Or at least most of y'all can't read that. So what am I going to do? I am going to make sure that every single Sin O Alice update that there is, is covered the day that it comes out. The day of. 
I will be making every update for Sinnoh Alice that includes the events and that includes when we get into release date. So I will cover every single piece of Sinnoh Alice info that I get. And when the game comes out again, yeah, I'm going in head first. And I'm going to get in there real deep. But obviously, I can't just be a Sinnoh Alice update channel. So what am I going to do now? Maybe this question has come across your mind for what game should I play in the meantime now, Techtown? Well, there is another game called Alone. And there are other games that I could make recommendations for. But it's not as fun going into a gotcha that already exists. It's a lot more fun getting in from day one. So I am going to give a recommendation for another game called Loon, which is coming out on July 23rd that I will be playing religiously on this channel. I also have a first impressions video, which I will link to at the end of this video in case you're interested in another game. And it's coming out in less than a week, y'all. So while Cinewiles may not be coming out now, it'll be coming out later. So yeah, I'll be covering Loon. And I might be doing a couple more games other than that. It's all up in the air, really. But until then, Sinnoh Alice updates, maybe some Skylanders, some Alone, all that good stuff. I'm going to keep on banging it out of the park. And once again, y'all, thank you so much for 5K subscribers, okay? That was absolutely huge. So, do me a favor. If you're actually still here, holy crap. But if you're actually still here, hey, let's just ease up on the negativity, y'all. Okay? The Sinnoh Alice Discord already doing an amazing job of that. that people understand this is going to be for the best so once again you can join my discord you can join the official Sinnoh Alice discord too which i'll link in the description get in there maybe express your disappointment but do it in like a constructive way let's keep the hype going let's keep the positivity in there and let's show the creators that even though we're disappointed we appreciate that they're doing it for the best also hey once again if you want to leave me a comment letting me know that you think i'm totally wrong and you think that they're totally greedy hey go ahead okay i read all my comments y'all know that y'all know that so oh i try not to ramble too much but hey that's the news for now if you want to talk some more discord either discords my twitch channel twitch.tv for test tech tone all that stuff i'm gonna get out of here but i hope you'll still stick with me until the actual release of the alice and thank you all so much for watching